The Tata Group will purchase 250 aircraft from Airbus. The agreement includes 210 narrow-body aircraft for Air India owned by the Tata Group as well as 40 wide-body long-range A350 aircraft. This is part of a massive deal which will be the largest aviation deal in history. Air India's 470-plane deal is also likely to include a 220 plane order from Airbus rival Boeing as the Indian Airlines Im as the Indian airline embarks on a decade-long expansion and reinvents itself under the Tata group. In a video call with the French President Emmanuel Macron, Ratan Tata and other world leaders, Airbus chief executive uh, said it is a historic moment for Airbus to help script Air India's revival. Macron said this contract is a milestone in the close ties between India and France. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has said India will rise to become the third biggest player in the aviation industry, adding that over the next 15 years, India will require about 2,500 aircraft. N. Chandrasekharan, the chairman of the Tata Group, said, we, on our part, are going through a massive transformation because we are committed to building a world-class airline. One of the most important things is a modern fleet which is efficient and can perform for all routes, he added. The latest deal marks a turning point for Air India under the leadership of new CEO Campbell Wilson. Wilson is trying to share the airline's reputation as an outdated fleet and subpar service provider. Air India's plan for 470 uh, new aircraft will be the single biggest deal by an airline, beating an American airline order for 460 Airbus and Boeing planes about 10 years ago. The transaction would be worth tens of billions of dollars even after the significant anticipated discounts. That comes at a particularly difficult time for plane manufacturers whose jets are once again in demand after the COVID pandemic. But supply chain concerns weigh on costs. Airbus earlier reported a poor start to 2023 with the deliveries of its jets dropping by 33% in the month of January over supply chain troubles.